Hi, it's Dwyer, GamblersAdvisory.com. When I was younger, and I used to watch these um, boxing shows and telecasts of fights, I was always amazed by Bert Sugar. He always seemed to know more than the commentators. He always seemed to have an opinion on fights that seemed to be a little bit outside the norm. And I was wondering how he did it. I couldn't figure it out. But many times he would go against conventional wisdom and he would pick the winner of a fight and he would be able to put it in a historical context. He'd talk about fight styles, he'd go back, he'd talk about Rocky Marciano, he'd talk about Joe Lewis, he'd talk about Ezra Charles. Then he would bring it full circle and he would say, that's why I'm taking this guy in this fight. And it was surprising because being in the moment, the fight looked closer or more lopsided than I thought Burt Sugar was acknowledging. But yet, more times than not, Burt Sugar was right. I'm online in large part because of the impression left on me by Burt Sugar when I was a kid growing up. I, I started to realize that there was a whole part of the game that I did not understand, that the styles not only make fights, but they transcend the fighters, and that the styles date back to earlier generations, and that, um, you know, you really can't be caught up in the moment in analyzing fights. Um, Burt Sugar died this weekend. He will be missed big time by me. And um, my prayers go out to the Sugar family. Thanks for watching.